Hello everyone, welcome to Disrail Photography. It is Thursday and it is Thursday Photography Insight. Today we are going to discuss the differences in focal length. Our topic of the day is generally focal length the different sizes of lenses we have. Focal length can be defined as the different measures of distance between that is the divergence or convergence of light in an optical system, a lens, so to say. There are different types of focal length. We have short uh, telephoto, uh, we have medium telephoto, super telephoto, and macro lens. I will break it down on which one works where and which one is suited for what type of photography. One, we are going to start with short telephoto lenses. Short telephoto lenses, these are well known for street and portrait photography. For example, the 85mm is a short telephoto. Uh, 135 is a short telephoto. These are best suited for portrait kind of photography. When you're taking pictures of people, streets and studio and taking beauty shots, things of that sort. They are best suited for that kind of photography. Short meaning the compression of the background and the difference between the subject and the compression of the background is so squeezed in that it feels like the background is so close to the subject yet it is compressed so to say. Letting the separation between them look so nice and smooth. That is a short telephoto lens. For example, the 85s mm, the 135s, and the 50 mm lenses. These are short telephoto lenses. We have we are going to medium telephoto lenses. They are best suited for wildlife. These are uh, medium telephoto. They are like 200 to 400, 100 to 100 to 600. Uh, these are lenses that are best suited for animal or wildlife photography, sports, and things like that. Bird photography. Yeah, that is medium telephoto lenses. I think the difference is now clear between the short and the medium telephoto. One is suited for portraiture, another one is best suited for another one is best suited for portrait for wildlife sports and things of that sort. Now we are going to another category that is called macro lens. Macro lens, these are these are lenses that are used to capture tiny subjects but magnify them to look so so crispy in a way that you, nothing compares to it. They are best suited for close-ups, basically. We are now going to super telephoto. They are best suited for sports, wildlife, and nature, and astronomy. For example, people who photograph stars on the sky and things of that. So this is a super telephoto lens, like the 200 to 1500 mm. People who photograph moon and things of that sort use super telephoto lenses. So we have short telephoto, medium, super telephoto, and a macro lens. Super telephoto for wildlife, nature, and astrophotography, we have a medium telephoto, sports, wildlife, and things of that sort. And we have short telephoto lenses for portraiture and street photography. Signing out <laughs> is our lens with this rail of this rail photography. I hope you enjoyed my lesson today, Photography Insight. Next time we'll be dealing with another topic. Signing out is this rail photography. Please remember subscribing to my YouTube channel as always. Keep creating, bro.